So I want to get that out of that tree. So I wrap my cable around here. Granted, this would not be the way you would do this in a perfect world because this will damage the cable. But I don't care. This cable's seen, seen better days. Also, wouldn't normally attach to a tree that tiny, but I need something to redirect it. And that's the only thing around here besides that giant tree, which is way farther away than I can get to it. Ugh. And I'm not leaving that connected down to my winch. I'm going to hook that onto here. Well, here you go. All right, and now I am out of room. Hi, Ted. Where'd you go, buddy? Were you heading home or something? <laughs> oh, boy. Still in the tree, but not by much. All right, so that's as high as I could reach. Got a more, th about three feet out of it. We'll see if that's enough to get me past that branch. Co-pilot's with me now. We'll give this another shot. Decided to go for another another route. So what I ended up doing here is I took the saw and I cut here because I figured if this snapped, this was going to hit this part, go past me, and this was going to fall there. Kind of cut up high on this, and now I'm just going to take that line, bring it back down to this crack point, and we'll see if I can uh, see if I can pull it backwards and snap it. That's handy. Alrighty. Probably could have done a deeper cut on this side, but we'll see how this goes. I'm pulling up high. That should give me enough leverage. But I've been wrong about everything else. Let's see if I'm wrong about this too. Say hello to my little friend. Alrighty. I should have cut that a little farther through. And then probably also bring this down so it's more at the snap point. Oh, I see that tree there's in the way. Aha! Yeah, so I definitely need to get it down here now. Instead, pull it down here. And yeah, we'll see how that works. It's away from that tree though. All right, gave it a little bit more of a cut. Brought my line right at the snap point. The only thing that could mess me up is I got this tree here. So, we'll see how that goes. All right, man, you ready this time? <laughs> Ted knows what you're ready means. There we go. Let's give this a shot. There we go. I'll run straight up through my line here so I got more that I can pull. Back in reverse. Alright, you watch the ship. You're good for a little bit. Alright, that piece came off fine. I'll just hook this back up through here. I'll get back to there. I'll give this another yank. And we'll, we'll see what we get this time. Probably the exact same thing. Let us hope not. Alright, you ready, Ted? It's ready. Alrighty.
Yeah. Alrighty. We're still there. Hanging in the air. I think if I take this piece here off, I should be able to drop that. I still have this tree to hide behind, so it won't clobber me. And then I can kind of lower that back down again, and we'll see what we get from that. All right. Now I'll lower that down. See if I can make more of a Widowmaker out of it. Yeah, this is going pretty awesome so far. And it'll go to this. And this is either going to stick it into the ground and pogo it up and over, or it's just gonna lift up in the air again. We'll see. I don't know. I'm kind of curious to see what's gonna happen now. Did you ever reach a point of no return where you're like, yeah, this is a bad idea, but I gotta keep going? That's where I'm going. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you know this is a bad idea. He's used to dead and his bad idea, so. Here we go again. Ready? Oh, you're gonna stay there this time? Good for you. Brave new world, Ted. Oh, come on, really? <laughs> Almost had it that time, though. So if we look up here, I don't even know what that's being held by anymore. It would have been a lot easier just to go up there and chop that branch off. But at this point, I'm committed. This is coming down. Take off another chunk. grip that and hopefully I can yank it out of the tree this time we'll see <sighs> really that's literally being held by the smallest piece that you could ever imagine Alrighty. Alright, in my never ending search of finding a way to do this way harder than it needs to be done, I'm gonna redirect that off my tree and I'll hook my cable up, which is right down here, and then we'll pull backwards this time. So our tree's way up there. So it's still safe for me, there's nothing that can happen. It's not gonna land on me or anything like that. But uh, I'll have that tree hopefully yanked over that way. I don't really know what's gonna happen. Let's find out, shall we? Alrighty then. All hooked up. Ted's ready to go. Emergency brakes off. Dog's ready. We're in reverse. There we go. Now it's 
straight up. See if I can lower it. <laughs> now it's straight up and down. But it is it's off the tree, Ted. I'm gonna consider that a win. Alrighty. Excellent. So now it's at its absolute most dangerous point possible. So all I gotta do is walk right in the center of all that danger, disconnect that clevis, and then we'll try and pull it this way. We should pull it directly toward us. You good with that, Ted? I don't know if he shook his head yes or no. It's too much player. <laughs> I'll come back to that. <laughs> Ready, Ted? <laughs> All right, my man. Here we go again. I wouldn't, I wouldn't, I wouldn't stand there. All right, so what I could do, because I mean, we're already, we're already pretty much as far stupid as I can get on this. That's, that's incredible, really. I mean, it's just, it's hanging on by leaves. <laughs> it really wants to stay there. I mean, a lot. All right, so I can send this around behind those trees. See if I can drag it lengthwise. I mean, now I'm committed. And I'm, I could get the chainsaw out. Sure. I could chop this now. I mean, we're, we're like 50 feet away from where we were normally before. I'm, I'm going to disconnect this. I'm going to send this behind the trees. And then we're going to... Yeah, I'm committed. All right. I'm actually breaking a sweat here. This is how stupid people get cardio. So, I am crazy. But I'm not going to walk into that stuff. So I'm going to take this. I'm going to throw this through there. I'm going to walk around down behind it and grab it. Hey, Ted. So I got my cable hooked up. <laughs> but my dog is gone. <laughs> and I don't know if he just abandoned me. Be oh, there you are. Okay. Sorry, man. I was talking crap about you. I just uh, I didn't want you running out over there when this is happening because this probably I don't know I'm going to claim to know how this is going to work so my line's running behind there and then down behind this little cut off stump of the tree that I got to cut anyway so now let's see how this goes I'm sure it'll go oh you're already in the right position I'm sure it'll go perfectly got to come down. I can't just keep holding those trees forever. <laughs> Woo. I was going to say, or maybe it can. <laughs> Holy cow, Ted. All right. Now I'll grab the saw because I'm just going to chop up the uh, dead pieces on that. Well, I'd say job well done, but it really wasn't. 